Kennedy, from the moment I met you in 2013, there was an attraction that immediately pulled me into you, and a chemistry between us that simply cannot be denied. Evan, I can't believe you're here today, eight years in the making. I'm so proud of how this relationship has grown, and I'm honored to be able to call you my husband. Like a true fairy tale, I feel so incredibly lucky to be standing here 10 years later, hours away from finally being able to call you my wife. I promise to be your passenger princess, your camping or glamping buddy, your Ollie co-parent, your housekeeper, <laughs> your plan maker, and your restaurant date. You're my person, my inspiration, my everything, and I cannot wait to spend a lifetime loving you. I promise to never stop doing the small things, like leaving notes in your lunches, bringing you home sugary treats even when you don't want them, and giving you arm scratches while you get sucked into my Bravo shows. <laughs> As we embark on this journey called Life Together, I promise with each kiss it's filled with more love than the last. I promise to laugh at life with you and even at myself, sometimes. I promise to always leave the radio volume on even numbers and practice the utmost patience when I'm driving. Now it'd be naive to think that every day could be like today, so more importantly, I promise to love you on the days that are difficult. As we enter this next chapter, I feel so energized and excited to take on all that life has to offer us. As long as we are together as one, I am confident that there is not a single thing that can stand in our way. How excited are we all to be here tonight? As most of you all know, I'm Nicole, proud sister of the groom, Monopoly player extraordinaire, the OG Bentley grad, and self-proclaimed favorite Caragiana sibling. In all seriousness though, I'm feeling so honored to be here celebrating literally my two favorite in the whole entire May your adventures always be wild, your laughter be courageous, and your skunk encounters, hopefully, be limited to childhood memories. That was my one inside joke. <laughs> you bring so much life into all of our lives, and you are going to make an amazing husband to Kenzie. I often joke around about having a small circle of friends. That's because having a friend like Kenzie for 12 plus years sets the bar for friendship pretty high. I have had the pleasure of sitting front row to the relationship for the last eight plus years from questioning the frat boy and if we should give him a chance, and yes, I meant to say we because you said yes to both of us today, to watching their love for each other grow, to moving in together, to expanding their family with their fur baby Ollie, and most importantly, watching them make each other better people. Your love for each other is inspiring, and I cannot wait to continue to watch your relationship grow as you enter this next chapter. And as your best friend, I promise to be there every step of the way. It is by no accident that you are here today. Each of you is someone really special in their individual or shared lives. We gather here today to celebrate the union of Mackenzie and Evan, a union that not only joins two hearts, but also the beautiful threads of the Greek Orthodox, Jewish, and Catholic traditions. As they do for each other, we too will celebrate not only the unique perspectives which each one brings, challenging us to look beyond and grow, but also their commonality in which we find a familiar comfort of what we already know. This love is enduring, unyielding, and boundless. An apt description of the love that Mackenzie and Evan share for each other. It is the type of love that exists when two people wholeheartedly give each other, committing to support, cherish, and uplift each other through all of life's challenges and joys. It is a love that weaves together the past, the present, and the future. A love that binds generations together. As you embark on this journey together, may your love be a beacon of hope and inspiration. And as we celebrate the love that Mackenzie and Evan have for each other, let us also celebrate the love that binds us all, transcending time, culture, and tradition. May their marriage be a living testament to the beauty of diversity, and may their love story inspire all who have had the privilege to witness it. As a symbol of commitment, I invite Evan to break the glass as he and Mackenzie begin this incredible journey into married life. Mazel tov!
little did we know when she, we dropped our Kenzie off at Bentley that she would get more than an education, but find the love of her life. Who is this Evan dude from New Hampshire who is now part of our family, which by the way, we are thrilled about. Well, here we are, Ken's and Evan now married and starting the next chapter in life as Mr. and Mrs. Parker. Oops, Mrs. And Mr. and Mrs. Caritianis, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's gonna take some time to get used to. We wish you both a lifetime of love and happiness and adventures. Let's raise a glass to Evan and Ken's. <laughs> For those of you who do not know me, who I have not met, I am Evan's favorite little brother, his knight in shining armor, who's been bailing him out of jail since day one. Just kidding. But standing in front of you all today, I can honestly say that not only is Evan now one of my best friends, but someone I turn to in life's most difficult moments because I know for certain Evan is the most dependable person that I know. There is, however, one other person that might just understand these feelings as well as I do. It is Mackenzie, who trusts and stands with Evan so much so that she is here today to marry that crazy, stubborn, difficult, and most authentic person I call my brother. She corrals Evan's crazy side and brings life to his best, most honest qualities. He will continue to show up for Mackenzie with that same vigor and loyal character as they navigate life together as one. Cheers to you both, and cheers to many holidays, boat days, and lazy Sundays together with you. Love you guys. Cheers. Oh, but we really feel blessed, Kenzie and I, to have you all here together. Everybody has been so incredible, made it made my life very easy. Um, who else? Oh, yes, uh, my beautiful wife. I now know fully why she's so dang good at her job. I love you so much. You are <laughs> literally what keeps me going. It makes my life so dang easy. You all better join us on the dance floor later. I am not leaving that dance floor. And let's have a great night. Orthodox, Jewish, and Catholic traditions, I am truly honored to present to you, for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Perijanis.